Let's go crypto review. Ethereum Bitcoin dominance. I, I love looking at that chart. And as you see again, Bitcoin is dominating. This is the shoulder that I'm looking at for the dominance to reverse. This is the head. This is the shoulder. And as you can see again, Bitcoin is just the superior asset so far, right? I expect at one point, if we hold that 3,034.50 on Ethereum, I suspect we are going to break the dominance once and for all. And we'll probably, we'll see here, a reversal of the power trend box signals. And that's going to be very important. Uh, a reversal of the power trend signals and from the downside on the dominance back to the upside. And I think it will bring Ethereum at 5,500. So let's look at the Ethereum charts to confirm that on the probability power indicator. These are unique tools and indicators in the world. We have a patent, we have copyright, we have a design patent, we have a patent pending for the IP in many countries. We have also trademarks with the word power indicators. This is stuff that are very unique, guys, that we traded with real money. There is no back testing, you know. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it was blood, tears, and successes over 30 years of trading. I started when I was 22 and 30, 52, right? So this our seeing is believing. Take a free trial, 30 days, money back guarantee. And if you don't like it, like it for any reason, we'll give you your money back. So now you look at the Ethereum. And by the way, last but not least, we have a light version of the probability box rule of third here where we divide divisions by third third. Sell on purple, buy on blue, right? Buy on blue, sell on purple. Everything that we do, you know, every trades that we get, you know, if you look at the Ethereum right there and you look at the dominance, look here, buy on blue, you would have bought on blue, it would have been 900 and thirty dollars sell on purple, and you can see they touched the edge of the purple and they totally rejected this uh, forty-one fifty and boom back down. So a lot of the trades that you see here in the quarter million dollar portfolio, guys, right, are based on the tools we use the tool personally, which is very rare, guys. In between the Schwab accounts, the Fidelity accounts, and the crypto accounts here, because I have three crypto accounts, right? You can see, right, that we do use the tools for entry and exit. I mean, it's very rare, the stuff. So if you look at Ethereum, ideally, obviously, you want to go back to the trend line, which is like 2,500. I don't think we'll do 2,500, you know, which would be the edge of the calculator the, the midline there, but I think the midline is still possible. We had a 3,080 something last week. I think 2,850 is still possible at the midline of the indicators. Now, last week we held perfectly the division of three on the probability power indicator left side at the, around the 3,000. So, this will be the re-entry or the add point like this, 28.53,000 target has not changed for me. We are looking at a 5,500 on Ethereum. So everybody says 6,000, 8,000. Look, I cannot invent target. I can only show you target that have worked extremely well, you know, for the past 30 years that we've refined, you know, with 14 years of development of indicators, and I can only give you what I see. Right now, I have a solid 5,500 target on Ethereum with a retracement of 28.50 and uh, uh, um, 28.50 3,000 round number. Sorry, I was looking at the position that I have right now. So let's look at Bitcoin now. 
because Bitcoin is a lot trickier with the halving coming. So let's look at Bitcoin. And we need to be very, very careful at Bitcoin. Why? Well, look at Bitcoin. One top, two top, three top. Usually, the third top, the third touches are the best one for, for break. Usually, well, it's, it's, it's more position usually for a break, like a new heart. And this is something I've learned for many years. You know, you look at the third break. The third break is the most important. So we should expect a new high. But there is a little shoulder that I don't like. And if we do the new high, everybody said 200, 300, 400,000. I know, but right now I can only give you what I see, which is 81,000. Okay? And this is the realistic target that I have on Ethereum. So... 81,000 on Ethereum is what I have, right? And the calculator and the probability power indicators might adjust and we'll do a lot more live events like this, more and more and more and more as we go. Now you have 81,000, but you have this little bit of a head and a little bit of a shoulder and a little bit of a shoulder here. We need a new high above that 737 fairly fast. We need to invalidate the edge of the probability power indicator top here, right? Because see here, you have a top here at 64.7, uh, then there's this top here at uh, 69.7. So we don't want to get out of this 60. Eight rule of third here. See this rule of third of 60. We don't really want to get out of the 65, 68 right now. So I'm going to put a parallel line on Bitcoin. Because if we get out of this area right there, right? The 68, 60, 66, 68. Then we are going to accelerate the retracement to the rule of third, which is here, which is your 55,000. So we need to be very, very, very careful. We have 81,000 here. We have 66,000 dollars here. And then 66 crack. It's game over for super healthy retracement all the way to about 54 to that 52,000. So let's call it 53, 53.5,000. So let me write them down for everybody because you need to engrave this for the next few weeks if you don't want to get destroyed in the crypto market and on Bitcoin and on your Bitcoin only. 81,000 top. We must hold the 66,000. I would also consider the 70,000 dollars be a very psychological number that would push the 66, which would push to the 53.5. This is where we are. We must hold the 70 and we must break this head. See this head? We did a shoulder. We have a higher high shoulder, which always for me is a dangerous shoulder. We must punch a new high on Bitcoin of 74,000 very, very quick. We want to push the 73.9 very, very quick on Bitcoin. Because if we don't, then the more we stay below the edge, purple, sell on purple, buy on blue, buy on blue, sell on purple. Look at the fantastic <laughs> signal here in 2022. Buy on blue at 16,000, sell on purple it completely to the tick. If I zoom, if I zoom, you will see it was completely the top so far. So I have the right probability calculator that can shoot to $81,000 on Bitcoin, but you need to be very, very careful of the numbers I just gave you.
Okay, so hopefully that was helpful. One more chart for the crypto, which is the total three, which is the total market cap of altcoins. I want to look at those for you and then we'll go stock specific and crypto specific, but we have only 20 minutes. So we'll have to go very fast. So let's pull the probability power indicator. Then we'll look at the power scanner three for one and look at this. Remember those indicators are very unique in the world. Nobody has those tools. We have a patent. We have an attorney on staff to enforce licensing and royalties on those tools. If you are interested to use those tools for your own analysis or you are an influencer, you can partner with us. Look at the partner details on our website, Power Indicators. We do lifetime commissions, meaning you send us a friend. You send us, you have an ecosystem, a community. We pay you commissions every month clockwise clock swiss precision you know and that's it and for life for the life of the users of the indicators okay now if you look at the crypto total three look here same idea we have a little bit of a head we have a little bit of a shoulder but guess what we didn't go to the top yet so I would like to see if they can push the total three, which is the Alcon right now, to the seven, to the 800, 800, 867 billion market cap. If they can push total three right now, 760 to 860 billion market cap, the, the, the Alcons are going to fly. And you see like here, I have a small position on uh, Shiba Inu, on one of my accounts, I don't know if there's an account number, if there's a name, but I can show you. I don't know if you'll see, but I have 16,000 dollars into this account. I have 3,000. I have three accounts in cryptos. I don't know if you can see it or not, but I have Shiba, I have Sui, um, I have Stacks, yeah, and 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 it's it's flying right now. So again. Watch this 750 billion market cap and this 860 billion market cap for total three. Because as you can see, if we hold, we have the conditions I gave you on the crypto analysis. If we have the conditions, one, Ethereum holds the 3K, preferably above the 3.5K. Two, Bitcoin holds above 66.70 and we need a new high above 74 quickly to go to the target 81k that would bring us a completely parabolic move to the top of the calculators on total three as soon as the 70k bitcoin breaks you need to be careful of the 66 break because that brings you to the 54 and by the way that could probably be a Christmas gift. Because in the crypto cycle, I look always at two big dump. That would be your first big dump. And so everybody that did not have the opportunity to re-enter, that would give you a huge opportunity. So hopefully this is helpful. Your likes, comments are appreciated. Don't forget, you can have a 30 days risk-free. Seeing is believing. If you don't like the indicators, get your money back, but give yourself a chance to know to have tools that helps you to go from where you are to where you want to be in trading and investing because this helps you avoid emotional decisions. The in, the out, the in, the out. That's how I got Coinbase at 65. This is how I got Meta at 100. Everybody, if you are new to the ecosystem, this is how I build up this retirement accounts you know, the 75, the 100, the $233,000, guys, to uh, uh, last year to a 27% return for the year. 27% yeah. return for the year. The best investor of all time, Warren Buffett, is 20%. That was 27%. No option, no future leverage. Those are retirement accounts. I am not allowed to do options. I am not using any leverage in my retirement accounts, guys. It's buy stocks, old stocks. And then you can see some of the incredible cost basis and you can look at some of our event on some of our stuff. But look here, incredible cost basis. 
Meta 118 and 206, right? Here, Coinbase, incredible cost basis of 78, 65, 71, 74. Coinbase was $265 yesterday, right? So this is really, really helpful, guys. But there's no promise. This is my account. I've done this for a long, long time. Those are the indicators that I use personally for my own account. And look, I cut up a Sui. I cut up a Shiba. You know, it's right there on the laptop. I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know how else I can show you. I have a laptop that I dedicate only for crypto accounts. 